Almeria province is situated the farthest east in Andalusia and the coastline is the least exploited. The coast is wild and rugged and interspersed with sandy, secluded beaches, the sea is as crystal clear as the air. Inland the landscape is equally wild. It is volcanic in the Cabo de Gata and there are gully-riven plains in the semi-arid areas of Tabernas. In the heart of the last semi-arid zone in Europe, is a landscape reminiscent of the wild west of America. Fort Bravo was built as a stage set for the many spaghetti westerns that were filmed here. Today you can mount a horse and amble around the western town to the haunting strains of the music from the film, for a few dollars more, before taking a beer at the saloon where you will, in all probability, find yourself in the middle of a shootout. The Sorbas Yesos Cast Natural Reserve is a good place to begin to get a feel for how wild this province can be. Yesos is layers of gypsum, laid down millions of years ago. It has been eroded into a karstic landscape, unique in Europe. At Pulpi we find the largest gypsum geode in Europe and the second largest geode in the world. A geode is a cavity in rock that contains crystals. On the coast, the popular tourist resort of Mohaka has one of the few wide, sandy beaches that is ideal for families. At the western end of the Paseo is a stunning cliff path walk along the coast, going past a castle and a torrey built during the 14th and 15th centuries. These were built to warn the inhabitants of the small coastal villages that raids were imminent by the Barbary pirates. Further east we arrive at the fishing village of Villaricos, where the crystal torrey guards the coast. It stands on the Phoenician, Roman town of Baria. People have lived here for well over 2,000 years, exploiting the rich agricultural land alongside the river Almanzora. The Phoenician, Roman necropolis of Baria can be visited by appointment. Along the coast from Villaricos, more recent, stone ruins tell a story of mining exploitation that exploded during the 19th century. The ore was brought to smelters on the coast before being loaded onto ships that moored in inlets below the precipitous cliffs. Today the crumbling remains of foundries, workers' housing, railway lines and aerial cableways are a poignant reminder of the more recent past. The westernmost beach in Andalusia is Cosadores. Fantastical sandstone sculptures surround a pretty bay. In the cliffs, small dwellings have been carved out by the people that came here to cook the esparto grass. This provided them with an income until the end of the 20th century. Perhaps the best place to appreciate the scale of the mining that went on, is to go on the Beda Mine Walk. It starts at a loading hopper from which the ore was taken by rail to Garucha, and takes you into the mountains past abandoned mines and adits, through tunnels quarried out of the bare rock and along mining tracks that were once trod by donkeys hauling ore carts. This is only a small taste of Almeria, a province that is packed with history which is still evident today and just waiting for you to explore. To find out more, please go to www.visit-andalusia.com.